How's it going everyone? My name is Amzo and welcome to The Root of Evil. The Root of Evil is developed by East Fog Studio and is an indie horror puzzle game. Now there is something extremely unique about The Root of Evil and that is the fact that is that the entire game was developed by a single person. The story follows a gentleman by the name of James who happens to be a telepathy, basically meaning he can communicate with the souls of the dead, ends up picking up a case that has a 20 year old history to it. Basically in the haunted house that he's going to investigate, a death happened, but the police deemed it as a suicide. However, out of the three people in the home, only one survived which happened to be the daughter. Now the daughter was then put in an orphanage and was then raised by a rich family, but on her 20th birthday she inherited the house that her parents died in. This is the house that he is going to investigate and this is where the root of evil begin. <clears throat> okay, so it's 5 a.m. no, 5 p.m. Have to see notes, okay? Okay, I can't open the door. No. Oh, where's the handle? It's gone. Okay, the door is missing the handle. Okay, there we go. Um, it's a little creepy. Oh, what was that? Okay, so that must be the husband and wife, 1890. It's kind of a weird place to put the date. Although this doesn't seem like an 1890s house, so... Let's see, more photos. Hmm. Uh, singer, singer... What is this? Okay, um, did it do anything? I don't think so. Let's see. Well, the only number that we've seen so far is 1890. And if this doesn't work, I'm going to try 1900 because. The daughter was going to be 20 years, and this might be a gift. You never know. All right, we got a key. Okay, so... Uh, the door hand... Oh, see, it's missing the handle. What? The glass is broken. Okay, can we go upstairs? It does not look like it. Okay. So we must go down this area. Okay. Uh, I gotta drag the key. Okay. Nice! Okay. Door's closed. Why do you have a... Wait, why is there a crow in here anyways? It's been 20 years since anyone's been in here. How's that crow staying alive? Okay, there's a broken key. There's a big ass... Pig face. I mean, if it's been... If it's been 20 years, this thing's gonna be decayed a lot more than that. Hey, there's fish in here? Good grief. Oh, I like when photos do that, where they take one big photo and they separate it into smaller ones and give that uh, artistic feel. I really like that. It's really cool. John Smith, huh? What a average name. Got some birds. It's kind of... It's a little weird. Why is there a window in the middle of the house? <laughs> okay. So, got 
some burners. What's this? Oh, cool. It's a puzzle. Uh, let's see. Lines up top. Okay. That looks about right. Um, like that. Looks like a bottom piece. Okay. Ah, uh, shoot. Come on. It's not fitting. It might need another piece or something. Okay. Come on. Okay. Maybe that doesn't fit there. No, it's got to fit there. How is it going to fit in that little hole? Okay. <laughs> what? Okay, so we got a puzzle here. Let's see. Got to get the uh, top pieces first. Um, okay. Good. New York, or the Times Magazine. Which then this would... Uh, this would be right here. Okay, just like so. Perfect. Uh, come on. And bingo. Bingo. Oh, come on, bingo. There we go. What? Oh, there we go. Married couple committed suicide in the house. Only the child. The case happened at night on September 13th. Victims were the Smiths. Their bodies were found under the house basement burnt. Police assumed that this was a suicide. The wife, after a long period of dealing with depression and short-term dementia, turned to a schizophrenia. She killed her husband, then suicide by the fire. Inside the house, the police also found a newborn. This baby was assumed to be the victim's child. The baby still survived and was taken to an orphanage to be raised. LTT. Lieutenant? Not sure. Okay, so... Um... 
I don't know the code to that. But, oh shit, this is open, okay. Never trust a closing door. What's that? No. What is this? Like, I'm not sure about what those things are. Little, uh, see, spiders, Africa, four, six. Okay. Gotta remember that. Not sure what it's for, but we'll figure it out. Okay. Can't open the door. Ah. Come on, spin. Here we go. See, phone number is 035 and some missing stuff. Can't use the phone anyway, so. Uh, she was a cat lady. It's a nice little uh, living room, though. Got yourself a little fire right there. You got a mounted goat thing up there. You can play the piano. Oh, well, part of the piano. Hmm. Oh. I wonder if there's another one in here. Quick, quick look. Oh, what's this? <clears throat> you got Socrates looking over there. The lady. Hmm. Would there be more spider webs? Oh, it's the beginning. We did. Oh, no. Shit. Um, this wasn't there before. Okay. That was my wife. She was a tailor. After the death of our first child, she was suffering from depression and short-term dementia. Recently, her condition getting worse and she doesn't realize what she was doing. This thing called her met many unfortunate accidents. Press tab to see notes. Okay. I use psychic abilities to connect with the soul of the deceased husband. He's trying to tell me something. Okay. Nothing. Um, is there anything else over here then that we can use? Oh, look, there's blood on the thing now. Okay. There wasn't blood on there before, was there? Can we go upstairs? Uh, looks like it's still closed. Let's see. What? One more time? Nope. One more time, come on. Oh shit! Did that move? It did! I'm gonna just go right around it. It locked again. Damn it! Still don't have access to that thing. What the fuck's happening? Is it 
because I opened this chest. Uh, okay, it looks like we're missing a piece. Hi, kitty cat. You know you shouldn't be here. I know, I know. Uh, do we just go around? Back to where we were? Uh, looks like it. Oh, what's this? It's a trap door. The fuck was that? Ah, uh, shit, you guys. It's missing a handle. It's locked. Can't get to that. Shit. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, man. Oh man, 1.30 a.m. So we got here at 5 and we lost a bunch of time. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Shit, it's locked. Need to turn on electricity first. Uh, need to get a key. Oh, there it is. Who puts a key on the radiator? Seriously. Okay. More ambient looking. Looks fairly nice. Oh, hell no. Um. Oh, the hell. This wasn't there before. What do we do? Since the death of our first child, my doctor said she couldn't pregnant anymore. 
I didn't know how she can. But anyway, this is as good news for us. Oh hell no! We got the devil in a, in this house. The devil goat thing. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't want to be in the same. Room. We're back here again. Damn it! The game kind of reminds me of Layers of Fear a little bit. Uh, well, that's shut. That's not good. Alright, can we go in the basement? No. Oh shit! Who's throwing bricks? That's not good. Although, we might be able to break this thing now. Oh, nice! Okay. I guess we need to get a final first. Look at that in the bathtub. Oh, it's a necklace. Oh, no, it's not. It's whatever those mark things are. Mark of the devil. Oh, cool. Oh, it's going to be like an angel or something. Or a horse. Oh. It's kind of cool. I like those shadow ones. Have you seen the uh, the art where they uh, create like faces one out of garbage, but then it's like the art is the actual shadow? Those are really cool. I like those things. Although they don't do that. Oh, that's kind of creepy. What? Like a demon hand. Seriously? You want me to go this way? You seriously want me to go this way? Oh, are you kidding me? We're back in the kitchen! So someone was just over here! Why is there a window in there? It's the bathroom! How weird is that? And that's... that's down. Wasn't that up before? Uh, looks like we're locked in again. So we got another puzzle. We gotta find it though. Is it the bird? No. Uh, broken key does nothing. Maybe it's this thing? I don't have a thing though. Oh, wait. Okay, cool. So, one, two, buckle your shoe. One, two, three, four. No? Oh, it, that's right, it fell. So, shit. Uh, okay. There we go. It's a necklace. Earring? Necklace? I found a maid. Her name was Mary. From now, she would take charge of the cooking and cleaning in the house. I felt that my wife seems she doesn't like it. But what important. 
Mary could take care of her during pregnancy. Yeah, but you also have the devil goat thing in your living room. Which, that's not usually a good thing to have. We're back in oh shit! What the fuck was that? It's a crowbar! Oh, we can probably uh, get this open. Perfect! Not perfect. Shit, we got another key to thing to figure out. Okay, um... Maybe in here? Nope. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a... It's one of these things. Was that five? Two... Eight. Five, two, eight. Five, two, eight. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> Five. Two. I mean, come on. So slow. Oh, cool, we got the handle. Maybe we can get in this door now. Come on. Uh, there we go. How'd, like, how'd you put that thing on there? You have, like, Elmer's glue in your pocket or something? Oh, he was a gambler. Uh. Oh, shit. Need a coin to play it. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a stupid sign. Oh, damn it. What are the signs even for? Is that another one? No, it's just a black spot. So we got a globe. Eight. Oh! Shit, hold on. Uh, six, four, four, six. Okay. Five, six, and three, four. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, they're not gonna attack me. Oh, it's uh, the, the phone number 653. Recently, my wife has some slight weird expression. She said less than before, and often angry with everyone. Sometimes I saw her crying, and sometimes saw her smiling alone. Once time, I was horrified when I saw her playing with the spiders. The doctor said she might be suffering from personality disorder. So she needs medication and a special treatment. Ah, oh, shit! The fuck am I supposed to do now? Hello? What the fuck's that? Oh shit! God damn it! <laughs> okay, well I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna end this shit right here. What do you guys think of this so far? Personally I think it's uh it's a fairly good story. Um puzzles are fairly decent. 
I still don't know what the signs are for. We got a chest to get into later. Thank you guys for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you're new and enjoyed it, you know what to do. Otherwise, leave a comment if you're awesome, and I will see you guys in the next one.